Hello again, friends. Today's detail is a 1993 Kenworth W900. This is a old truck and it's a dirty truck. The customer just wanted it cleaned up a bit, but don't invest a lot into it. It's just an old truck. So I did the best that I could, but the age and the wear and tear definitely was showing and it made this detail a challenge. There were quite a few challenges in this detail. Uh, the first of which was the embedded dirt. Whether I was using the magic eraser or the detail brush, it just did not want to come out. My daughter was able to work some of that dirt out of those surface lines uh, with a detail brush, but she had to hold it really tight, work on it one little piece at a time. It's just not a practical way if you're having to detail in a short amount of time, but she was able to make it look good. I used the steamer, I used the magic eraser, it just wouldn't come clean. The other problem is this was obviously not taken care of, so you had grease stains on the back, um, grease and dirt, it was just stuck and caked on. Uh, there was smoke and dirt on the walls which are that uh, obviously it's a pleather but it was uh, definitely a difficult thing to handle so I had to pull out uh, the super clean and put it in my spray bottle full strength I didn't have a choice and it did break through all of that but it was still a challenge nonetheless I mentioned my daughter she is the mom of five boys so she gets all the boys to school and she didn't have anything to do so I told her to come on up we weren't very far from her house and uh, she could help do one side and help knock that truck detail out so uh, we definitely uh, were able to make some good progress in a shorter amount of time uh, than I would have if I had done it by myself Plus, this was actually a two-part detail.
So I mentioned this is a two-part detail. I'm actually going to also be removing the lettering from the exterior of the vehicle. Uh, that will be in another video, so keep watch. The day that we did this detail, it was extremely windy come noon. It was a normal wind up until that point. And then the wind kicked in and I kept getting slammed into by that door. That's something that big trucks are notorious for. They'll squish you in a heartbeat. So my daughter took some of those vice grips and pinned the door open because ouch. With the carpeting, we just did the best that we could to vacuum out as much as we could. And we also uh, used the extractor, uh, used some of the uh, uh, Zep on it just to kind of break some of that stuff up. But I knew there was just no way it was going to come clean. But in the end, the truck actually turned out pretty well. I'm not going to complain considering it's an old truck. It's been through a lot. These trucks are made to work. So I'm, I'm not displeased. I'm actually pretty happy with it. 